So this question is technically a diagram question. Again, any question that provides visual input, I'm going to call a diagram question. This looks like the information is set up as a table. So we have years, we have two years, 2012 and 2013, and then subscriptions, subscriptions sold for those years, 5,600 for 2012 and 5,880 for 2000 for the year 2013. So the question goes on to say the manager of an online news service received the report above on the number of subscriptions sold by the service. The manager estimated that the percent increase from 2012 to 2013 would be double the percent increase from 2013 to 2014. Let me just read that again to make sure I got it. The manager estimated that the percent increase from 2012 to 2013. Well, let's just figure out, well, what is, what is the percent increase between 2012 and 2013? So what I do is I just divide 2013's number by 2012's number. And what I get, <clears throat> let's see, 5880 divided by 5600. Zero, zero. What I'm getting is 1.0. Five, which means this was a 5% increase, right? This 0 0.05 represents 5%. So it's the 5,880 is 5% 5 higher than the uh, 2012 number of 5,600. So the manager estimated that the percent increase from 2012 to 2013, 5%, would be double the percent increase from 2013. So we expect a 2.5% increase from 2013 to 2014. How many subscriptions did the manager expect would be sold in 2014? So if we're at 5,880 for 2013, and I want to figure out what that is plus 2.5%, right? So this represents my 2.5% increase. And again, if you don't understand where the decimal comes from, right, the 2.5% as a decimal, you move the decimal to the left twice, so that becomes 0 0.025. And since we're increasing, we're adding that to 100%. And again, the decimal on 100 is at the end of the number. Move that to the left twice, we're at one. All right, so that's where the one plus 0 0.025 becoming the 1.025 comes from. And now I just have to go to my calculator and say, well, what is 5880 times 1.025 or the 102.5% increase? And what I get there is 6,027. Therefore, the correct answer here is choice B.